Hi, designers. Today we will discuss about cold cavity extraction of the simple part. Later, we take a difficult samples and we will do whole design of it. So, let's start with the initiating project. Just to change, just delete a space and make underscore. And I would like to take a PP, there is no PP over here. So I manually enter. So just select the none and enter your shrinkage value over here. So 1.5 percentage for PP. So now by default sticking options. So as you can see, my orientation is wrong. So I need to change the orientation of it. So whenever you Whenever you make a top view, so you okay, just select the face and check all logs and change its orientation. Okay, I think I need to run again. Z axis should be always downside to core side. It's uh, towards cavity now. Rotate this 180 degree. So double click it and drag it. Okay. So when you make a top view, from, just cross check by clicking top view. So it will look fine. X, Y should be always first quadrant. Okay. Now we'll create our piece. It's not changing anything. By default, it's taking. So this is uh, this is my first video on core and core and cavity. So I'm taking uh, a simple part. So check region and face also check. Here you it's three degrees there, so change it to point one degree. So you take minimum uh, drop angle to distinguish uh, core and cavity. It's automatically generated at the parting line and pass surface. Just click apply and we'll move on to pass surface. So it looks fine. I need to patch it later. I redefine core and cavity. Core and cavity is make a body. Click it, it's automatically take a pass surface. Okay. So I'm now next person next term I define core and cavity which was undefined by the software. So manually I'll change uh, faces. So here you can see there are undefined faces 24. So I need to redefine it. So I'll go to cavity set. I take this uh, faces to cavity set. Just click the cavity region and select the faces. My mouse is a little hard, sorry for that. Click on the faces. And uh, it's look fine. So, cavity set is OK. Click apply and check leftover. Uh, This step is very important to define your parting surface. So all the pan surface will get filled and uh, this final parting line will be created in the next process. So always make sure define regions are zero. So I'm heading to to create parting line. So four pieces better so now there is only single uh, parting line for this uh, 
component, simple component it is. So, so I'm clicking next. My buttons have created. So next is importance of is patching all the regions with button surface. So I'm patched all the regions. Now I'm extracting a core and cavity. So I got my cavity, I got my core. So it's quite simple. In the upcoming video, I'll uh, show you how to make a local insert in this sub insert you can say. So it's look fine. So hope you enjoy the video. So try at your end. Make sure you like and subscribe my channel for uh, more videos. I'll come uh, the next video we'll discuss uh, all base and uh, cooling of this component. So hope you enjoy the video.